Today I'm at the White Horse near Thirsk and it's just the beginning of these steps to the very, very top of the White Horse. So today I'm at the York St Patrick's Day Festival and I'm speaking to Brendan and you're the organiser, is that right? Yeah, one of the organisers. One of the organisers. Yeah. Today I'm visiting Roundtree's Park and I'm going to tell you a little bit about the history here and why so many people love to come and visit the 30 acre park. And you can drive down here or you can do my favourite thing and walk alongside the river. Red Nose Day is just around the corner and this amazing charity helps so many people's lives in the UK and in Africa. And Rhyme Station is one of their official partners and I'm here today to find out what exactly they're doing to fundraise for this event. Scarborough is a beachside town in North Yorkshire and thousands and thousands of families visit here every single year and the town's got so much history and I'm here to tell you exactly why so many people come and visit Scarborough. So today I'm at Stilling Feet Lodge and I'm speaking to Vanessa Cook and you're the owner and you're kind of the bit of everything here. This isn't just any old club in town, this town has an abbey, a connection with Captain Cook and Count Jacka as well. This is Whitby. And finally the York Bar Walls which is 3.4 kilometres long, the longest medieval walls in England. Garfield is in the Yorkshire Dales in North Yorkshire and I'm here today to tell you exactly why is that wall is so brilliant. So let's begin. The popular river walk brings all sorts of sights to see, from the river boats to the amazing cafes or just enjoy a lovely stroll. The cockpit, look at the far horizon, because that tells you uh, that you're the right way up, doesn't it? And now we're about to go over Whitehorse Bank. So down on I'm Natalie Eaglin reporting.